Hello and welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West. So before we start, I want to say that the mod's working. As you can see, I don't remember the exact number of these valuables or resources that I can carry. But I do know that I should not have 200 ammo. And I, ha I haven't upgraded the hunter pouch. So yeah, uh, the mod's working, and I think it's gonna be crazy because that's a huge number of supply. And also, I want to show you this uh, wrong button. I have this supply. I don't know. I gotta restock. I gotta restock. Huh. Uh. Okay. So. So I cannot take that. Okay, can I take this? Uh, yeah. Oh, that's for the chess one. Yeah, the stuff that I never done in the original playthrough on PlayStation 4. So I'm full of this, I see. I don't think I want to care. This is an explosive, though. This can be quite useful early on let's bring it and also this armor i i think this is better because i don't think i'm going to face enemy like close quarter hopefully so yeah and let's sort it out let's wear this yeah, and let's equip this. Uh, let's put that there. Yeah, uh, let's go with that. Now, what is that? Ah, uh, let's steal from this guy. Yeah, uh, it used a blast base. I need a lot of those. Yeah, okay, anyway, uh... I think I'll accept each and every side quest and then we will complete the side quest before progressing with the main quest I think maybe that's going to be better uh -huh. okay I see it I hope Corvin and the others are doing better than I am oh this is the miner guys what happened to you that damn mine is Yeah, the collapsed mine. I remember this quest. It won't be the last injury if Olven keeps shoving those tongs into those tunnels. What mine? Northeast of Chain Scrape, where the river ends. I told Corvin we should stop when the first cave in happened. But <sighs> Olven probably threatened to cut off her pay. Or worse. How about you slow down and take me through it? Okay. You mentioned you were injured in a cave-in. Yeah, <clears throat> a couple days ago. That's how I hurt this blasted leg. <laughs> Corvin and the others were opening a new vein while I was checking on an older one. As soon as the blast hit, the tunnel I was in collapsed. Might have dodged it if I wasn't running on barely a spark of sleep. We were pushing too hard and too fast. And you're afraid Corvin and the others might not be as lucky if it happens again. Mm-hmm. Hit the nail right on the head. Okay. How come Olven's in charge? Don't these mines belong to the Karja? Try telling Olven that. He brought in all the backing to get him open. Might as well own them. <laughs> Fire and spit. You ask him. He owns us as well. Who's Corvind? He's our foreman. And a damn good one. The kind that knows how to deal with management when it gets unreasonable. But Olvind, <laughs> his demands go beyond unreasonable. Corvin's been doing his best to appease him. He even blamed himself for my injury when it was Olvind who ordered the extra shifts. Sounds like a good guy. Mm -hmm. That's why we all put up with the long hours and lousy conditions. But if the whole mine becomes unstable, yeah, it's I'd not rather worth suffer it. Olvind's wrath than die buried in rubble. Okay. I could check in on your crew if I'm in the area. I. 
would appreciate that. Thank you. Oh yeah, by the way, I think the easy loot is working too because resources. Yeah, I got this from killing the enemy normally. I think if you don't destroy the parts, it will still be there. You can take it. But if you destroy it, it will just be gone, like destroyed. Yeah, okay, uh, two more side quests. Let's go for it. But hear me out. Okay, one is in the hall. Is this the food quest? Oh, come on. Yeah, it's the food quest. Hey, Milda. Milda. I took some of your stew last time I went into the wild. It kept me going for a week. I felt like I could have put a strider in a sleeper hold. Enjoy it while it lasts. Sounds like you're serving up some uh, impressive provisions here. <sighs> Not again. You can have the discount too, but you'll have to come back later. I discount. think you have me confused with someone else. Oven didn't send you? No. Oh. My apologies. It's just that his minions won't stop pestering me. <sighs> now I've even worn out my special grill. Since I'm in the midst of a crisis, perhaps you could skip to what it is you wanted? Some of your food? Of course. Okay. Are Alvin's people causing you problems? Oh, yeah. They constantly demand my best, but the equipment I need to make my signature dishes isn't built for batch cooking. And don't get me started on the Olven discount they feel so entitled to. And if you refuse? I make meals, no trouble. How did you end up in Chainscrape? Heard about a new and upcoming town at the edge of the frontier. Where there's a town, there's a tavern. That was a need of work. So I got myself out here and started cooking. Some of these people had never tasted proper boars and berries stew before. Anyway, next thing I knew, people kept coming back. Guess they like my food. Or the ale. Okay, let's help him. Your last him. customer mentioned your cooking really kept him going out in the wild. Where I'm headed, I could use some of that. I would be happy to oblige, especially since you have the decency to ask pleasantly. But... But my special groove griddle is no more. Without it, I can't cook any of my signature dishes. I hate to think what'll happen when I'm forced to refuse Olven or his goons. Even if I already had the right ingredients, there's nothing I can do. Unless the smoke you can source me a temporary there. replacement? What do you need? For the ingredients. A few pieces of decent wild meat, and I'd say a big handful of bitter leaf stems. That'll do. As for the griddle, a corrugated metal panel might suffice until I can have a new one forged. You'd likely find one in a scrounger pile if you follow the river to the northeast. Don't worry, I'll clean it first. <laughs> You'll have no issue finding boars and bitter leaf on your way, assuming you're as much a hunter-gatherer as your clothing suggests. Thanks, Smildaf. I'll keep an eye out. So that's what gratitude sounds like. Oh, wow. And don't let anyone push you around, okay? If you say so. Okay, that's another quest. Yeah, I think that's a pretty far location, which I haven't been there. Now, one more quest, and then we will go on our way. Uh, somewhere over here. Oh. Oh. Um. Oh, it's this guy. We all know the yeah. That... Bristlebacks into the valley sent them straight through the gates of barren light. That is preposterous. Why would we let dangerous machines into our own land? You mean the land that honest Osram laborers work tirelessly with no say in its governance? The land that should you sign the decree? Oh, you that, that damned concession decree would be managed by the people who actually live and work on it. Okay, that's what it. What do you want, Aldunt? Some kind of payment? My dear magistrate, you think I can be bought? 
If you want that whistle blown, all you have to do is have your soldiers remove the bristlebacks and sign the concession decree. Face it, what other choice do you have? <clears throat> Hi. Savior, what auspicious timing. Might we discuss a matter of importance to the Sundom? We might. Later. Very well. I shall be waiting. Yeah, we will help oh, that guy. The savior herself. Walloper of Durval, gutter of youth. Oh, Hill is yeah. that guy. I've heard many tales of your beauty and heroics, my fierce lady warrior. Olfant Friol, at your service. So, what could have dragged you away from the fine silks and wine of Meridian to this smudge of a settlement? Your saviorly attention must be needed elsewhere. I'm here for the embassy and- The embassy? Why, well, uh, by the forge. Ah, greater gears for greater matters. Guess that means you'll be moving on. Once I've dealt with any problems around here that need my saviorly attention. Ah, the bristlebacks, of course. Got to get rid of them if you want that embassy to take place. Well, best get to it, hey? And off you go. Not so fast. Mm hmm Okay, let's don't talk. Seem to have a high opinion of the magistrate. Well, I refuse to play nice to some fancy-robed parchment pusher when my fellow laborers are being bullied, intimidated, and taken advantage of. How noble of you. Noble, ha! Ah! Born with a hammer in hand, I was. Nobody handed me anything or dropped opportunity into my lap. Everything I've achieved, I've done on my own. And where is this hammer now? The uh, burden of leadership forced me to set it aside. The Karja risk nothing while demanding that good Osram gamble with their lives out there. Someone had to step up and say no more. He really tries to talk while gathering attention. You ordered the work stoppage? Indeed I did. We're laborers, not soldiers. Until the Karja clean up their mess and give us the fair deal we deserve, I'm not risking Osram lives. You yeah, see? Fair deal? You mean your concession decree? <laughs> it's not my decree. It's on behalf of all the good Osram laborers of this land who do all the backbreaking work while only the Karja reap the rewards. All we're asking for is the ability to share in this prosperity for a land worked by the people for the people. Right. And just how much would be your share? Only an amount appropriate to my contributions to this community, uh, of course. Okay, more There's of chain this shit. Chainscrapers on Karja ship. land. Shouldn't a Karja be in charge? Who appointed you? The sensibilities of good Osram folk, of course. You think a Karja can head this whole venture? Ah! The magistrate can barely make the trek from Baron Light without losing a few screws. So you have no real authority then? People only follow you because you say so. Loudly. Anyone who has followers has authority. I've been with Chainscrape from the beginning. I mean, I'm practically its founder. And its honest folk know I'm indispensable to its success. Huh. You said you founded Chainscrape. Somehow I doubt that. Practically founded, I said. I alone saw its potential when it was just a smattering of tents in barren light shadow. I invested in the mine, convinced some friends back home to do the same, and here we are. You could say chain scrape is what it is thanks to me. Oh, so you're not just standing around and profiting off everyone else? Not at all. Sure, I make a little return on my investment here and there, but my main priority, as it was from the beginning, is to look after the well-being of these Honest, working Osram. Okay, a fair bit of warning. A lot of this gameplay is going to be me talking and walking around. Where's the whistle? Right in the middle of town. But with the threat out there, I'm not endangering innocent Osram lives. I'm going to clear out the bristlebacks. And when I'm done, this valley is going to get moving. If that's what it takes. Until then, I'll keep looking after the safety of these good folk. Just be ready to blow the whistle. Okay, I do love Aloy. Let's see what that Karja magistrate wanted. Yeah. I 
he's in the tavern. I think he's pretty far back. Uh, oh, okay. I'll keep that. Oh yeah, the yeah. Come for that beer after all, eh? Let's talk to her. I think she will give us information. Get a pint in her hand. Um. Wasn't expecting you to swing by. Maybe both places. There's that spark. Fire and spit. Uh, fire and spit. <sighs> That's a blast from the bellows. Won't fix the forge, but at least I can forget about fix my troubles the for forge. a while. Like hmm. what? Take your pick. We got bodies to bury from the bristlebacks, the work stoppage, Olvin grating the gears about his concession decree. Hey! Weapons off the table. Ah, don't listen to me. Nothing a cold brew and knocking some heads together can't fix eventually. Yeah, I think there's a couple of NPCs that's going to be like her. Uh, they will give us information about what's happening around places that we can visit or maybe some quest, some interesting area. So the bristlebacks in the daunt. <sighs> Where did they come from? That's the thing. No one rightly knows. They just showed up one day, rampaging around the valley like they exploded out of a forge. <sighs> Lost some good people. But I heard talk of some vanguards trying to take them down. Did yeah, they come here? Stop by briefly for supplies. Olvind was none too pleased. Won't be able to crank it to his advantage once the bristlebacks are gone. But how could bristlebacks and the daunt help Olvind? Two words. Concession decree. Since no one knows where the bristlebacks came from, Olvind has taken to blaming the Karja for him. He's hoping to dig up enough old resentments to get a strike going until the concession's signed. This is just his latest attempt. He's been trying to rile up the workers since the day he rolled into town. And people actually believe him? Lots of folks suffered at the hands of the Mad King during the Red Raids. Give him half a reason, they'll blame the Karja for anything. I just ah, realized this. Karja slavers. Maybe it's the angle, but her, the other female, not Eloy, her hair kind of have a blue tint in a certain angle. I don't know. I thought you'd be back in Freeheap. Well... After the big battle at Meridian, I went back, but realized it was yeah, running see? smooth. It's blue. Didn't need me. Heard about the rebuilding out at Baron Light. Figured they could use another hammer. Been scraping by ever since. You could always leave. And go back east? Nah. I ain't one to leave a lit forge. Besides, someone's got to be a squeaky wheel for the workers around here. So about Olvind? Around here, everything's about Olvind. How'd he end up in charge? He got here early, like a squirrel smelling a fat nut. He knew rebuilding barren light would need stone and timber. So he jangled purses all over Mainspring, getting investors to front claims on anything in the Daunt that might be worth a damn. Thing is, all the bankers back home know that this is Karja land, and the Sun King can revoke those claims at any time. That's why he's desperate for the Magistrate to sign off on a concession decree. Okay, this he's trying to get decree. the land. What is it exactly? And how would it help Olvind? It's pig diddle, that's what. A writ that would put all Osram claims in the Daunt under Osram law, even though they're on Karja land. It would mean that any existing ore, stone, and timber claims couldn't be revoked by the Karja. No more risk, no more hesitation for investors back in the claim to pour in the shards and expand their business. And since Olvind has a stake in all those claims, it would make him richer than a scrapper in a junk heap. Not to mention Chainscrape would become an Osram municipality, so he could buy enough votes to call himself an elder man. He's a sly old badger, I'll give him that. Figures if he keeps up the pressure, eventually the magistrate will sign. No, we will help him. Okay, oh, let's yeah. go talk to the magistrate. Going. Thanks for magistrate? the drink, Magistrate? I'm glad I stopped by. Anytime, Flamehair. 
Okay. And this is the chess game. I've already played this in the main series when I first played it. So I will skip it for now, but I will do that on my own too because this is a PC version and I do want to 100% this game. Yeah, Jafar, the willing. Savior, thank you for taking the time and my condolences that you had to endure all the bloviating. I've dealt with worse. It sounds like he's really trying to put you over the barrel. The idea that the Karja purposely let Bristlebacks into the dawn, it's... <laughs> It's completely absurd. But the louder and longer he says it, the more support he'll get for his damned concession decree. How did the Bristlebacks get into the Daunt? No one knows for sure. The first report of them came from west of the quarry. But unless they have wings I don't know about, I don't see how they could have come over the mountains. No other way in. The only way I know about is barren light. Look. If you can get to the bottom of this, I can offer a considerable bounty in return. Help me shut Olvent up. Sure, let's go. What is this concession decree that Olvent wants? He wants the Sundom to designate portions of the Daunt as Osaram Holdings. Only the portions, mind you, that produce any value. Let me guess, because he stands to profit somehow? Exactly. With the Daunt under Osaram law, he could secure more investment for their numerous ventures. He can't get those investments without the concession? No. Not while there's a chance the Sundom could revoke their access. Hence, why the concession is so important to him. And why blaming the Karja for the Bristlebacks, no matter how absurd, works in his favor. How does blaming the Karja for the Bristlebacks help Olven get his concession? Look around. This may be the Sundom, but chain scrape is all gears and rust and bad ale. Claiming that the Karja loosed the Bristlebacks in order to intimidate Osaram laborers into obedience... Well, let's just say no one here has forgotten the atrocities of the Mad Sun King. And with the Bristlebacks bringing work in the valley to a halt, Alvunt has plenty of time to pick at barely healed wounds. And if the Osaram refuse to work, unless the concession is signed, you won't have a choice. Correct. The reconstruction of Baron Light must continue. How did you get stuck out here? I asked for the posting, believe it or not. Overseeing the entire valley on behalf of the Sun King? It was an honor. Is an honor, I mean. But your job would be a lot easier without someone like Ulvind blasting hot air all the time? Ulvind's not going anywhere. He's been around longer than I have. Even fancies himself the founder of Chainscrape. <sighs> now I'll find a way to live with him. I have to. Yeah, he's a good guy. Let's you said help the him. Yeah. were first spotted west of the quarry. Yes, according to one terrified laborer, said the ground trembled before they came charging down the hillside. He took off and ran all the way here. Good place to start looking then. If you learn the truth, maybe Olvant will stop blaming the Karja for every problem under the sun, and maybe then he'll actually focus on rebuilding Baron Light instead. Okay, let's get to it. Let's see uh, something over there, which might not be important. This is the scrounger site for the quest, the food quest, a place to climb. I think, is this the lake? I think this is the lake. There's a way down here you can dive into. Uh, okay. Let's go there, but let's mark this. How do I make this? Okay, that's how I mark it. Uh, let's go out. Yeah, let's climb there. I remember there's something above that I might want it. 
and then we will head to the scrounger and to the cave i remember the caves going to be a pretty long area so that might take this whole video exploring that area yeah let's go i want a better weapon i remember using my sharpshooter bow like my most favorite weapon in this game and i want that you know what i think if i manage when i manage to get to the other side of this yeah when i manage to get over here to this open area i think it's somewhere around here Oh damn, I forgot. I think it's somewhere around here. There's the like big settlement of Tanakh that you can get basically the best weapon and equipment in the game. Uh, why can I? I want to go up. Okay, I cannot go up from there. I can go up from here. Nice. Uh, I remember. Yeah, there's this house. I think I can climb from here. Yeah, let's do that. Wait, okay, this is the path. Uh-huh. Be careful not to let this stain my hands. Okay. Hunting the uh, resources, hunting the parts that needed for the new equipments. Going to be pretty easy because of this easier loot. I really, I really hate that I missed that loot because that option. This place has seen better days. Because I remember I. I'll mark the spot oh. in my focus. I'll come back later. Huh? I don't think I can get past them. Guess I should leave it for now. I remember there's something we can do on top of there. Yeah, that's like quite a long way to go. Uh, I think we will need to find a special item or equipment to destroy that flower, the metal flower. Okay, I think we need to go there. Holy crap. She almost killed herself. There's something up there. I think we can gather lenses to trade for stuff. I forgot if that's in this game or is that in the Zero Dawn. But I think we can climb to. Oh yeah, it's this one. Some kind of device. Yeah. The metal reflects the sun. Send a signal? Looks like some kind of lens. Yeah, there's like there's six of them. The Looks like a long climb to get up there. I don't have my... Okay, I can go down from here. <laughs> if you have a shield, it's basically just jump and have fun. Since I haven't got a shield, I can't do that. So, let's go. This scrounger, and then we will head to the cave. I remember the cave's going to be a pretty tough area. There's quite a bit of enemy there. But I think that's a good chance for me to try my blast bow. Okay. I think we can drop down from over here let's craft you know what i think i'll keep crafting until i ran out of supply because i think the next explosive that's a good one is like a spear thrower and 
that's like pretty far ahead. Or maybe that's in this area, I forgot. But I think that's pretty far ahead. Maybe in barren light. I'm almost out of machine muscle. Okay. Let's save. We are in the area. I think I can drop down from here. No, 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 it's further. Okay, hopefully I can drop down from here. Yes, I can. I think that's the location. That's a scrounger. Cross would do a lot of damage. Yep, that's a scrounger. I see a couple of them. Let's mark. Okay. Now hide. Okay, I think I can do one shot of Scrangers. them all, but the question is... Let's see. Uh, is this the one? No, 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 no. I think... Oh... Maybe I should have... Ah, uh, you know you know what? It's pretty far down there. There should be a way to increase my stealth attack. Is it this one? No. This is Silent Strike. Yeah, it's this one. It's this one. Let's buy that. Uh, okay. Uh, how do I... I'm, I'm pressing... Okay. I'm pressing space, but it's not buying. I, I was. What happened? Yeah, sure. Let's take this. Might be able to help. I don't know why the space not working that well. I need to press it a couple of times to buy a skill, but yeah. Exploring cauldrons might teach me how to override these things. Uh huh. Damn. That hits an armor. There's another one. Okay, that's actually a good decoy. Now if you, if you can come this way too, then I can kill you, right? Ah. Yeah, she's blending with the grass. Really? Really? Huh. You You're just moving away. Ah, uh, okay. So, want to come over here? No. Yes. Yes, get over here. Get over here, and then I can stealth kill you. Okay, goodbye. I 
I don't think it's coming this way. I could use fire against it. I think it's blind. It's not coming this way. Uh, it's dead. Oh, uh, wrong button. Wait, R is a map? Oh, no, no, it's because I'm using the travel pack. So that's why it's asking me if I want to move somewhere. Okay. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff that I can take over here. Better check another scrap pile. You can check over here, it's safe. There's only one left. Yeah, it's coming over here. Oh no, it's looking this way. Ah, okay, this is going to be pretty dangerous. Yeah, it's realized what's happening. Okay. No, it's stupid. <laughs> okay. Go over here. Come over here. Yeah. Check and see what's hitting you. And you're dead. I think that's it for this area. I think we can. Gotta look through the yeah. scrap piles for a metal pen. We can check this area freely. Okay. I think it's gonna be this one because it's a purple one. I think I have yes. everything I need for Nilda. Good thing too. I can use a decent meal. Okay. I think there's gonna be a couple more items above there. Uh I think there's also a ah uh, come on. Come on. I I just remember how I hate the climbing in this game. It's so awkward. Okay, a couple more boxes, and then we will go to the mine. Yeah. I have a lot of this little berry. Can I send it to my pouch? Where is it? It's this one. No. Huh. Because there's 73 of 300 here, but there's only 10 in my pouch. I... I don't know. Oh, wait, there's... Oh, there's more. Okay. Yeah, at the end of this main campaign playthrough, before I get to the Forbidden West area, after I find basically every weapon in this game... Oh? Oh, I think that's the camp area. Anyway, before I get to the end of this main campaign, main story, I think with this 10 times mod alloy, we'll have a supply of ammo for a legion, perhaps? I think that's the area for the mine quest, right? No, that's a camp. Okay. Uh, feels dangerous. Feels destroyed. Okay. A 
Aha. I don't see anyone here, but this area feels like something's going to happen here. I don't know. Let's continue. We should go right. I don't know why the sign told us to go left, but we should be going right. Oh, the quest change. That's why. Yeah, I, I, I forgot about that. I completed the food request, and there's an enemy over there. I think that's another machine's weak to burrower. Okay. We can try to kill it. I think that's the other one. So there's only two. It's so much easy to aim with mouse and keyboard. I'm loving this. No. Okay. I think I missed a little bit there and hit the eye armor. Anyway, I still killed it and I can take the loot. Yeah. Oh, it's so nice. I think the echo, the sound shell is needed to craft the like resonance arrow or something to destroy parts, which I don't think I'll ever need it again. That's a charger. Level 13, pretty high level, but I think chargers is like a passive one, so they will not attack you if you then if you don't get close to them. So let's stay away. Smoke. Coming from where Arnav said I'd find his crew. Oh wow, it's attacking. Okay. Only one attack, the other one just run away. Yeah, it's on caution. I think I saw another one. What is that? A burrower. This must be the mine Arnav told me about. It looks like the miners are in trouble. I'm fine. There are others that need help. Savior, please. I just started running. I didn't look back. I, didn't look back. I don't see a quest mark. We okay. So we're heading into the mine. There's something over here, and there's a shelter up there. Let's check that, that out. Looks like the foreman Arnif mentioned. I should check in with him. Okay, so just a fast travel area. Sure. Hmm. What is this? Ah, oh, stash, the chest. Let's take this one last bow. Yeah. I'm sure that one arrow is gonna mean a lot. I think. Is that one chasing after me? I think that's one chasing after me. I don't know. Okay, so this is the foreman. 
You good? Hi. I'm okay. Thank you, Corvin. Corvin? Corvin? I'm not not now. Easy. What happened? Explosion in the mine. Water flooded the whole place. Some of my guys are still they're still down there. I can't can't stop. You've done enough. Are you hurt? I'm... I'll live. The others. Please. I need to know exactly what happened. We used controlled blasts to open up new veins in the mountain. One of them must have gone wrong. I can't... I have to go. How many are still down there? Two? Corvent, how many? Uh... Two. Two, I think. Yeah, I still quite remember it. I think two it's more. only over a year since I last I played this. So I will remember quite a lot about the story. Okay, finally, it won't charge us. It leave me alone. Let's see. Can I loot anything? Do I want to steal from this poor guys? I guess not. The snow brought the chill. Maybe I can craft more. Let's craft more. Gotta find those two miners. Quick. Yeah. Uh. Oh. Okay. I want that chest. Okay. Now, this is going to be a pretty simple area, I think, until. How do I get that? I want that. Oh, uh, I can pull it if I stop the water, maybe? But I don't... Oh, oh, yeah, remember, we will stop it later. Yeah, let's focus on going forward. Okay. The miners. One of them doesn't look too good. Let's see, there's nothing over here. We're gonna get out of this. I'm hearing a burrower. Are you okay? Who are you? Corbin Your savior. Oh. Are you hurt? Uh, my leg. I, I. I was a little too close to the blast. What happened? We were blasting in the farthest tunnel. The scaffolding didn't hold. It collapsed. I... I think it blocked the drainage shaft. Water started flooding the place as quick as I drink ale. I barely managed to drag us here. So something's keeping the water inside the tunnels. What are you thinking? I've got an idea. Are there more explosives? Are you crazy? Yeah. Should still be some up top, but... You'll need these fuses. Are you crazy? <laughs> you can't move. <laughs> and I'm not leaving you. It's not like she can make things worse. Don't go anywhere. I think I can. If you leave it to me, I will make it worse. Hopefully. Wait, why are you not diving when I want you to dive? Okay, boost. Almost there. What is that? I think that's our way out. Uh, 
Okay. <laughs> Made it. There's the debris blocking the shaft. If I can reach those explosives up on that track, maybe I can blast through the blockage. Oh, wow. It just sank into the bottom. Okay, uh, I don't see anything else. I'm hearing a brewer, but I did not see the shadow of it. From the sound of it, it's around this area. Okay. Let's see. Now, this game will have a pretty terrifying underwater area. Because there's going to be enemies there. I don't like that. I really... Basically, I don't have too much of a fun of underwater enemies. Especially when you cannot fake back. How do I get there? I don't know. Yeah, I remember there's a main quest where we need to go to the underwater area. Avoiding like two crocodiles. Or maybe there's more than two. I forgot. Anyway, uh, let's continue. We are heading this. Okay. Okay, three of them and no place to hide. Maybe I can stay. Really? It instantly detect me? Just my luck, eh? Okay, I think there's another chest over there, but I need to take my breath. It's checking. It's going here. It's checking my position. Okay, let's move. I think there's another chest over here. No? Wait, I can go back here. There's a block path over here. I know, I know. I think I missed this area. I think when... What is that? Oh. Yeah, I think when I first played this, I missed that area. Because I don't remember going back here to... That chest. So, yeah. Okay, someone... Someone saw me. Is it really coming over here? No, no, no. Okay, let's fight. Oh, 
Why are you jumping there? Climb here. Stupid climb. I forgot how frustrating it is climbing in this game. Hello. Did you see me? Okay, it almost called for help. Okay, its friends saw it. Oh, I can refresh it. I'll have to find a cauldron out here to learn how to overlap it. Oh, wow. I think that's all of them. Now to find a way out of this world. I did not know that. I never know you can refresh the... Hidden area. I thought that's a one-time use only. Okay. I should follow those tracks. See if they lead to the explosives. There's a chest over there that I want to take. There's also another chest over there. Don't do anything stupid. Oh crap. It's very dangerous. Okay, let's see. I don't think I miss anything else. I think so. So let's continue. Okay, I'm sorry. I thought I heard something. I I don't know the sound in this game is very good. I feel like I'm hearing stuff in real world. Uh what did I scan? Oh there's a chest down there? I don't see Oh, it's inside that area. Okay. Now, I don't want to go over there. Let's climb up here. Yeah, the climbing is like really annoying. She just want to attach herself on something that I don't want to. Okay. See where this leads. Yeah. I don't see any document. Okay. The explosives up on the track. Just need to get oh, close somehow. I don't think we can go back to, to this area again. Maybe we can. Maybe I can do that area if I'm playing this on New Game Plus. I don't know. Okay. Oh, really? I miss. Yeah, huh. Maybe I need it a little bit more to this side. 
Yeah, like that? Ah. Uh -huh. That's my mistake. I need to jump. Jump. Yeah, finally. Okay, now a way up. Yes. Let's stick the chest. And... Wait. I can pull this down. But what about the other one? I think, yeah, it's over there. Okay, I cannot go there. Maybe if I... Oh shit, I cannot... Oh, oh shit. I cannot breathe here. Yeah, I think that's like the place for a new game plus. I think if you play it on new game plus, you should have the shield. So you can fly. And that's how you can reach that area. And maybe have something to pull you. To pull you up. Okay, let's do this again. Oh. No. What? Oh, with the fuse, yeah. I forgot, oh wow. I think there's going to be a battle. That did the trick. Oh, yep. That got its attention. <laughs> ho ho ho! That achievement, it's blocking my. Let's go check on those miners. Fuck, man. How do I get up there? Okay, I can pull this. Yeah. I can grab it. To this area. Now I can jump to this area. Yeah. Walk here. Yeah. Now can I jump here? Oh, I can! Ah! Oh. But what about that area? Wait, really? Ah, uh, stupid. You know what? It's tools missing, right? Uh, okay. Uh, how do I change? Floor up? Floor up? No? Floor down? No? Uh... Yeah. Missing tool. So I guess at some point I will go back to this area. 
I guess on my own. She's so dead. We don't She's know so that. dead. Hey, I'm back. Sorry to disappoint you, boys. That looks like everyone's okay. <laughs> you did it. Yep. I thought you blew yourself up. Almost. Are you two okay from here? I can get this idiot down. Don't you worry. Thanks, kid. 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 Wow. Okay, I remember there's going to be an item over here, right? Better let Corvin know his men are all right. Oh. Oh. Uh, it's yeah, it's over here. Cool. And it almost killed me again. The chests here are like a dangerous things to do. Pulling the chase. The chest, not the chase. Chest. Okay, uh out. No sliding. Let's heal up a bit. Now I have 80. Can I Send that to my pouch. Where is it? This one. No. 89. 10 is in my pouch. 80 is in my inventory, I guess. Huh. Okay, let's talk to Corvin and then I will end the video. There's a save point over there. Hey, I did it. I found the two you mentioned. They're safe, but could probably use a hand. Is that everyone? <sighs> it is. I dread to think what would have happened if you hadn't shown up. I knew we were blasting too much, but the man who staked the claim here, Ulvent, <sighs> he kept pushing and pushing me. I tried to shield my crew from his constant demands every damn day. I... I should have been stronger. You were there for your crew when they needed you. That counts for something. Ulvan can threaten me all he wants. I am not letting my people back into those mines. Will you be all right? Yes. I can take it from here. You are owed, Huntress. At least give me something. Ulvan's name keeps coming up. Uh, uh, yeah, sure. Sooner or later, someone's gonna have to deal with him. Okay, now... I can talk to him. Thank you, Huntress. I'll see the last two make it out. That's it? Thank you, Huntress. I'll see the last two make it out. Oh shit, what is with it? Oh. I don't know why he have this exclamation mark. That usually means you have something you can talk you, to Huntress. him about. I'll see the last two make it out. Ah, uh, you know what? I'll just let it go. There's a couple of buck here and there. Oh, okay, it's going to this side. Let's talk over here then. Okay, so only side quest here. We've done two side quests. Completed one. This miner, there's another one that we can complete, the food one. And... Oh, no, no. I keep pressing the wrong button. There's... The... Uh, who was it? The willing. Something, something, the willing. Find the source of the bristle back. But we will go to the main quest first. Yeah, it's along the way, so I guess this is going to be our next quest. I, I will report it first, so let's pick that. I will report that, and then we will head to the main quest. Yeah, only side quest here. I don't know what's up with this exclamation. I hope when I save and load the game, it's gone, and I don't miss any dialogue, but hey. It's just a dialogue, right? Okay, thanks for watching, and I will see you again in the next part. Ciao.